Hello, my name is Oleg and today I'm going to demonstrate you on how to receive purchased goods in your warehouse. Video will contain of two parts. First part is the creation of the purchase order in the uh, order interface. And second part is um, receiving goods at the warehouse input area with MRP warehouse software. So first of all, uh, let's create a purchase order. I have already pre-created a request for quotation and as you can see I've added five products into the request for quotation. Let's confirm order. So now as you can see the purchase order uh, was generated, also incoming shipment uh, was generated as usual. Uh, let's print out purchase order in this standard order functionality but we have customized a form in order to have the additional barcode field as you can see it is here we will need it at later steps at the previous steps we have created purchase order, send it to our supplier and finally truck with goods have, goods have arrived to our warehouse and we are sitting at the front desk in input area of our stock. So uh, we have a printed out purchase order form with the barcode. We have hardware scanner MC3200 with MRP warehouse installed on it. So let's launch MRP warehouse and in order to start receiving goods we need to click on warehouse operations and click on receipts menu point. Uh, now we have only one purchase order available but there can be so many of them that it's very hard to find them quickly. So we created a procedure of quick search for purchase order for incoming shipment by the barcode of purchase order. Now you see the form where you can start scanning product appeared and we are starting receiving goods. You see that we are expected to to get seven RZD drives but we received only one so we click in one click enter. Now you see there is a message about three left warehouse operations. Uh, now we need to proceed scanning with other goods until we, we are done with all of them. I will show you another way around how we see expected operations. If you click directly on purchase order there is a list of to-do operations and operations finished. If you click on create back order it will create back order for the non received goods on background here it is and now if you will click on particular item in the back order for example hdd drive you will see details about it and you see that incoming good is marked with a yellow color uh, that means that we need to confirm that this good is actually what we expected. We are scanning it and now it appeared as a green. We are entering 6, clicking confirm and now we are done with this operation and can proceed to the next operations. Thank you for watching.